Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all well. And welcome back to Mizano. Uh, this time though, we're in a BMW uh, for the round three of my DTM championships. Uh, I've run a qualifier where I place second out of 18 cars. And as you can see, we're gonna do a night race for a change. So let's get this underway and see how we go for eight laps. Okay, let's see if we can hold on to second. Hopefully. Stick nice and close to that Audi. Get a second there. Oh, some Mercs push through behind. Come out of Variante and head into. Looks like you came unstuck. Head into Rio. No brain fade there. So, one of the things um, that I realised over the last couple of days is that the URD cars, as you can see, because you can see straight through the wing there. Um, they have DRS enabled obviously because the, the 2018 cars do have DRS um, but if a track doesn't have DRS signs defined the cars will use DRS everywhere which is why I had no chance of, of sticking with them through qualifying or during the races in the last two rounds um, and obviously Mizano, well not obviously, but Mizano doesn't have DRS defined so um, for the qualifier I used DRS everywhere, as did the uh, AI, and um, we came within seven hundredths of a second for the first ten cars, so it's, it's helped a fair bit, um, and as we go around this track you'll see where the cars are using it, so this car ahead will use DRS, there you go, DRS just activated and dropped, and we'll use it again there. Which is a bit of a shame, I mean the only way I can really fix it is to unpack uh, either all the tracks I'm going to use and define DRS zones that are either correct DRS zones or zones that are um, outside the scope of the, all the length of the track so the cars never actually activate or it's to go in and edit the cars and then repack them. I don't even know if I can do that with the cars because they're a paid mod and I'm not sure if um, the URD um, cars are encrypted or not so So yeah, I might have to just uh, play around with the tracks that I'm going to use. Either make sure that I've got DRS zones defined, or for those that don't and they don't actually use DRS, I might just define zones that are um, way outside of scope so that they don't actually get activated ever. Oh, I'll make the Mercedes is trying to push through. Put my DRS on. So here, for example, I've got to hit the brakes well before there. That bump, because with DRS activated, the car's super squirrely and we'll just flip out there. And the same here as we come through Cavone, you'll see that the car gets very squirrely in the rear, just there. So you've really got to be committed to the line you're on because you can't change it. But as soon as you hit the brakes, the car becomes super responsive and grippy in the rear. As DRS deactivates. Activate DRS, catch up, and activate at the same time he does to try and not lose that. Lose that bit. As you can see, I've already got a flat spot as well. So, as you can see, if I activate DRS there, I can't actually keep up with the AI because they have much better car control than me. But I can activate it here, not a problem. And keep up. Which I'm happy to do. I mean, I can do that for the rest of the series or I can try and make it right. The other option is, of course, to drop to the like the 2012 UID cars because they don't have DRS at all. Oh, oh, let's push through. Wonder if we'll be able to pass through Cavone here. It's going to be tight. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh yes, took it back. Nice. Fairly clean too. Now last year the DTMs um, did actually run uh, a night race at the zone. Um, pretty cool spectacle, um, but it wasn't a, it wasn't a, um, a kind of a planned thing. They actually had a clash with the race on the same day, so they had to run a night race, which I think is a bit of a shame. I, I like the spectacle of a night race. Having said that, though, the, the DTMs do actually run um, enduros as well during the season, so this year they won't be running uh, a night race at Mizano. All non-enduros are, um, are starting at 1.30 in the afternoon, so there'll be no night race there, which I think is a bit of a shame. Use as much of the circuit as possible here. I'm just here, like I said, I've got to activate, oh, sorry, deactivate DOS by hitting the brakes a little bit earlier than you would if you were normally racing. Just got to keep remembering to hit DRS. Oh, that flat spot's getting worse already. It's kind of caro. He's activated DRS, so I can't do it there. Can he, though? Pretty good. Not really losing out on it. Just make sure I don't put it in his boot as we come up to Rio. Can I get past? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Don't think we're going to be able to outbreak him. Not too bad. We should be able to get past this straight. Inside line. He's not really pulling away, which is good. I love the circuit under 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 lights, especially with this car, the front windshield and all the smears on it. Really, really kind of make it come to life. Inside line. Oh, use the gearbox as much as possible there. We get through. Oh, we did it. Wow. Oh, nearly too far there. DRS on. Mercedes right behind us. This line as we come through Cologne. Oh, and the Merc behind us fully lost it. 
Let the Audi come back. DRS on. And again. Oh, <laughs> that wheel's shocking. over me. Pretty good line through there. Whew. Flat out all the way down to Casilla now. There's all the track on exit. A little bit light there when you activate DRS. Can we get a Tremonto there? Pretty good, I seem to be keeping them at bay. Well, they are gaining a little bit. Don't stuff this one up. position swap behind. They're really going for it. Gotta keep this guy at bay. Come on, come on, come on. Last lap, here we go. Don't stuff it up. Oh, it's going to try and get past. <laughs> these insides. Got a good exit here. Ooh. Too early on the DRS then. Back on. Uh, Mercedes is right there, isn't he? Is he going? I guess he's gaining. Oh no, come on. Okay, commit, commit. Oh, <laughs> he's lost it too. As we come through Mizano for the last time. Ooh, and across the line. Wow. Oh, that was a, uh, a little bit intense. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, I certainly did. Um, if you did, uh, please give it a like. Um, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell, and I'll uh, be sure to upload uh, more content soon. Thanks everyone. Bye.